Hi guys, even as I was coming up the stairs uh, a couple of minutes ago, I was listening to that song by Hillsong's Worthy is the Lamb seated on the throne. We crown you now with many crowns and it comes, there's a line in there that says, the darling of heaven is crucified. And it just so hit me again as I began to think about that, I became very emotional at the thought of the darling of heaven, the darling of heaven. Uh, the darling represents someone that you have a great affection for, you've got great time, someone who's special, someone who's, who's set aside, someone who's not just the ordinary. Um, the, darling, the, 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 the darling of heaven is the one that everyone in heaven loved, the one that even the Father himself loved. So the darling of heaven was crucified. The joy of heaven, the peace of heaven, the hope of heaven. The darling is the one that you bestow your hopes upon. The darling is the one that you give your attention to, you give your time to. You have a special affinity and a special connection with and this is the one that the Father sent to, to be crucified. And it makes us look at John 3 verse 16 in a different light way. It says, For God so loved the world, how much that He gave His only begotten Son, not just His only begotten Son, that He gave His darling, that He gave His treasure, that He gave His joy, that He gave the one that He gave His hope to. He gave that one to be killed so, so that all who would believe on Him would have eternal life. The darling of heaven, the prize of heaven, the joy of heaven, the one that heaven rejoices in, rejoiced in and rejoices in, was given as a sacrifice for you and for me so that whosoever would believe on him could have access and become darlings of heaven as well. I want you to know that, that the Father loves you and me so much that he gave his most precious possession, not just his pre most precious possession, his most precious son, that we who would believe would become sons and daughters of the living God as well. The darling of heaven was crucified for you was crucified for me to take away our sins and to open a door whereby we now have a spirit of adoption whereby we can call God Father. We can say He is our Father because of what the darling of heaven has done.